Well, well, I'm sure gonna keep you up with those. In the meantime, Kadafra finds a great entry onto Dirk, and Jusu is keeping that on and on. Great kills coming over here on the B side. I think it's a fantastic game mode, but unfortunately, uh, it's not the sort of thing that you want to be bringing in uh, to. Already entered the side of B, and this has already been occupied by the Fnatic side of things. Spike planted. Quick one for one trade over in the mid, and actually the spike pushed all the way up. No control over the back of B anymore as Durka now has that spot. Trying to go for this retake, actually very tricky. There's a lot of pressure across the rest of the map. In mid as well, it's being controlled. And a hard push to start. Yeah. Suddenly, it's a man disadvantage that happens over over on the side of a line. Snow picks up the map, and now they have to go for the retake over on that C site when there's control already being exerted. There's trap wires behind. There's so much intel. Fnatic have the upper foot here. A bit of an awkward scenario when suddenly those defensive mechanisms of the Fnatic side have been established without even a single casualty. And retaking this spot is going to be costly, not only with casualties, but also time-wise. And Derek is obviously dodging that little trailblazer. No chance for the Tasmanian Tiger to bite anyone. And he's waiting back in the corner. Still an option coming in for Magnum. And here's the assistance you're looking for. Good old Nils. Yes. No chance for him. Excellent trades coming through from Fnatic. Look, you and I could discuss this for hours, but I think the more important part is if Boaster can hold off with these shock darts against the push potentially coming on through. The knives already in, but a triple frag comes through for the Fnatic squad. Traded for two, but it's getting dispatched down the long Durka night and find a proper frag. In the meantime, though, Magnum is being eliminated in the Hunter's Fury. Doesn't seem to find a thing at the moment, but it's Durka who starts off good with that. While Slucker remains patient, first kill found, the second is not granted, and suddenly the defense on the A side is somewhat weakened. But you gotta get the spike down, and Domas on it with oh. a triple! That's beautiful. Weaponry is not really inviting you to take such a well-fortified I mean, site, but here it comes. Yeah, I was gonna say, look at where he sat. Like, this is a standard place yeah. for the Killjoy to drop this ultimate, getting those lineups. The question is, does Boaster have the oh. counter lineups to get, just get rid of it immediately with those shock darts? We'll have to wait and see. Retake, though, already straight on. They're already starting this defuse. Oh, and, and the problem is right now, not only the flank from Gitaver work, and one player is Defuse. detained. Slucker is totally joining that, and it is... Ults to be invested here. Four players all the way up to beat. Maybe just get some fast ground here. Get some fast frags, if you can. Alliance struggling to hold out this initial push, but the spike looking to get planted. That's beautiful. And Slucker is even keeping up. That's going to be the B-side in favor of the German and Mystic as he still tries to take this one nice. home. He's still on it. Most definitely the Seekers though should have identified where the final Fnatic Soldier is standing. And he's standing strong, but some tasks are also impossible for him. And Ten seconds left. As he should. But lucky to be able to get as far as they did. And there it goes again, Dirk. It's starting off good over on the side of eight. This was swift. And only with Kadabra remains to do some of this Abracadabra stuff. But Boaster got the same the A side itself. Magnum is coming close. Ooh. And that is the spike delivered on a silver platter right here. But it is isolated. It is split off. A really heads up barrier <gasps> no! wall there and lands a second headshot over on a Boaster. Drops the res and Alliance have this round now. Mystic again with it all to do. And it seems like such an odd mistake here from the side of Fnatic. Mystic once more proved like he has the capability the to clutch things. But look at that. 35 seconds and three opponents remaining. One of them being... Let's not hope this will happen once more. Yeah, I do. I mean, Ted Star did win their game. They did win the game. A nice ping out onto Feroth. Finds Dome of the Kill. And the angle found against Kadavra. It's not going to matter. Durkin nails it. So does Jusu. Playing forward up in mid. Dropping that spike down. On the Fnatic side. Who just might run into the skull of Kadavra. Yep, he does. And a little flick is no tough task for the Frenchman. Magna might be just lurking around. But Doma holding the side on his own here. I got my doubts, John. And it seems like they are for a good reason. Doma able to find Jusu though. Now... Playing from hell, they have the plant, they have the spike down. Oh. Uh, did they not check it? Oh. Doma finds Hold two. On. A quad kill looks for no. the next. And what? it's an ace coming through from Doma. And that's it right there. Right? Yeah, there you go. Just miscommunication coming through from Alliance. It must have been. I mean, that's the only oh. reason I could think that to happen. We'll have to put that aside for a minute because Fnatic not slowing down one jot. That tactical timeout wiping out.
Yeah, still got to recover from that one, but either way, Dirk is showing what he can do with the tiny blades. As Jusu is waiting patiently for the players to come around, but Boaster has to reply to this. And as they want to take the plunge over on the B site, still a few more obstacles in the way. And specifically, we're talking about an individual having a lockdown he could use anytime soon. But first of all, he's trying to use the bullets in his magazine. He knows where Boaster's around. He still finds Magnum. And this leaves it only a locker. Does he have the right timing? Not too many more bullets. Three overall. He's got a fake it once. But don't play mind games with Boaster because you will lose this party of chess as he still considers to swing. No, still a little belay over on the wooden floor. And left, right, and center, he's checking. No clue where Lucker is coming from. And he still needs to defuse. And oh. he's still taking him down. This was one hell of a dance. And it seems like this salsa comes to an end. They are going to have four alliance. It looks like they were looking for picks. You can see they've got someone on the back. And there's the pick they were needing. Um, they realize what's just awaiting them in front of the gates of the side of A. And Fnatic is waiting patiently as Derkin keeps on hitting those beautiful taps. It leaves an only down to Hype. And he's got to start doing his best using bald impression to run over to A. But he's not even doing that. Rather sneaks around. Right hand side. It's already Doma awaiting him. Two more on the left. It's not going to be that one of an easy task. And it seems they haven't realized, but behind him... Oh, hold on! Oh. Doma's whiffing his shots! This can't be happening! At the same time, in no universe, that spike has to be planted. In no universe, this can work. He's dodging around. Fnatic, you talked about They have the submachine guns. And let's say it like that. There are more ideal weapons than that. As though... It is actually Mystic falling off a of fall damage, breaking his ankle and leaving it down to only Doma. He has whiffed, unfortunately, in the previous round, but this time he could become the savior nice. and he will. Oh, this back and forth, you talk about nuts. It's Dorka being tacked to 26, it's not making it any better right now for Fnatic Squad. Though it is Mystic and Boaster in combination doing a proper job. They cannot prevail over on the site. It's not going to be that easy for Fnatic to keep it up, but as Durka swings and comes even with that flank, that, that might be just a nail in the coffin for this round number 15. Jusu got to play one perfect round, still could heal himself if he feels like it, but I got my doubts, and well, it seems like they're justified. Four seconds, and that's the spike not going to be planted. They even know that there's a player there. Can't even find a final kill. Juice goes down. They can do, but the Seeker's coming in for Alliance. Doma has anticipated before it all happened, but Gaddafra is ending up behind the back of Doma. He's still alive, hides into his own smoke. But he keeps up going for fights, losing that one indeed. Costly for sure, don't get me wrong, Fnatic still only playing with three. As once the majority is killed, there's going to be a big rebuy in the next one. But the primary goal here is to find success over here. Lucker is passing away. Well, not most Watch literally. And as you hear the beautiful German accent, this is how it could sound like. But in the meantime, you only hear the gun sounds. Hype is finding Dirk, and same goes for Luck with Mystic. He's finding another! Boaster is being brought to... Dirk is realizing what's coming up, and hits a perfect entry over on Lucker. No time to end up in despair because you still got a flank in the form of Kadafra coming around a little too eager and Fnatic realized that another player could have passed through and it's going to be that B-side hit which somewhat comes in with a flank Hype is still around Hype is going to be blinded Dirk's also taking down Jusu but it's still Firaf who stands with his teammate but no chance in the end Aw, uh, Dirk is just waiting for it He's being detained Well. At the end of the day, a little bit of a worrying aspect that he can be taken out of the game that easily. This is giving him a slight advantage in taking the side, and this is what they do with East. Doma is the point man, eliminated, and the refracts are coming in again and again, but obviously this is not done when Sturka falls. Same goes for Boaster, as he's swinging around, finds another, the triple is secure, the quad could come next, and he gets Whoa. that quad as well. Dirk's on fire, that is for sure, but Locker is knocking on the back door any second soon, and Dirk is realizing that. Boaster is here to support, and suddenly they're all blind. Locker wants to get that round, double digits for who is the question, and he's still Still keeps on tapping the bomb. Dirk is on it, and the ace Huge. is well deserved. Ice cold. If you work one, I'm sure you want to run into his crosshair. Other than that, you don't want to run into your crosshair of Doma as well. Man's on fire. Sure, he had a few to have his bodyguards around him. Hype is definitely locking them in, and here we have the green wall. Tree cloud for optic, but other than that. 
the retake abilities of the Fnatic side look ideal. They have enough abilities and also ults that would help them out to obtain control. But now, you gotta stay careful first of all. They know about the mid-control that Juzu holds, but do they also know who's waiting back in window? That is one of the things. At the same time, Lucker's waiting outside of the gates and more players are coming towards the site. The defense remains strong though. Lucker's teleporting oh, in bitch. and he's taking him out. No! No. It's Dark who is getting the no scope, and you end up in front of his peril. But high has an opportunity to deny it. One. John. Looks like the Killjoy will be dropping that lockdown. Some train. pretty sneaky little spots you can stick no. alive in and stay unlocked down. Durka able to get the shot down onto Hype. Mystic swings out from hell for another, but Firoth looking to try and do something into the round finds too. Finally taken down by Mystic, but Jusu looking to rally on through. Has the spike, moves to control, spots the flash around the quarter. The focus right now for Alliance. Well, for Alliance, it seems like it's time to shake off the cobweb off those weapons, and it seems like this is exactly go. what they're doing. Just ask for it. Thank you very much for doing so. Appreciate it. Vielen Dank. And as we're getting into the 12 to 11, it seems like we might just even end up in a tied up situation, but there's still Dirk is sneaking up from behind, and that little turret didn't figure out a thing! No, Dirk, what? he whiffs like that! Just get caught by surprise, and it's a flawless! It's not- I get past this wall, don't really want to wait for it to time out, but there's no one really that close by- As Juju plays around the edge of that omen smoke... <laughs> Is that going to work that well, is the question. Once more, patience is key, we know that. Blocking sight. Blocking sight. And as we see their flank coming in over on the minimap in the form of Firoff, is that even valuable? Durka finds Jusu, but Kadavra is still there, and Durka is now even slowed and makes a lot of steps, is going to be killed as well. It's a free versus free, and the flank was not even relevant. They might just be able to stick that thing, and they will definitely do so, but they'll fake it as much as possible. Every single piece of utility is coming their way, and now we start the action. It's half. Locker oh. keeps on, but is being killed. And very honestly, Kadefra shouldn't. Through that just wasn't time for Alliance to come back on in. Hype going down early into the round meant that those rotations formed this team that obviously had a few hurdles into their way, but Fnatic? They most definitely have issues against this team, and this will be a promising best of three, but for now it is a promising haven. Where Mystic missed at the players to his left-hand side. Oh no! Oh, he finally needs to kill him, and he oh. even gets the double! Doma's on the right-hand side, and Man is eager for more. Realize that there came a few shots over out of that smoke. Nice. He still cannot support. That is the spike that still doesn't hit nice. the ground. Kadafra is looking for the ace, but Doma says, ah, I'm having none of that. And stuff from Doma to be able to control the site. Fnatic see if they can bring that overtime confidence towards Ooh. their side as well and the dismiss coming through from the bottom that's magnum obviously but in the meantime starting off strong is going to be the plan from dome as fear of still takes out mystic it's not going to be that easy over on their side yep dome is going to fall and jusu has been performing strong really solid for the team and we saw him on the sage last time around Sage crucial here, but another one to come through as well, looking for another stand-up performance. I can double check that one, but uh, we'll see if that one comes on through. Cadavra opens up the fragging again. Alliance doing a lot of work. Jusu dismisses around the corner into the waiting crosshairs, but Alliance still standing strong on the defense. One enemy remaining. And just around him. Underneath Mystic is waiting with the barrel. Pointing in the direction of his Last teammates, and well, he's realizing what's up. Mystic is not having him on the radar right Ooh. now. He passes? He passed through it! I'm surprised Lurker let uh, Mystic get away with that one, I'll be honest. I think <gasps> that this is absolutely brilliant coming through from Mystic. The timing is impeccable. No! Seeing another one. Then we have full stop to Lurker's round. That's Magnum. Finds yet another. These heads in a row. They're looking good to keep five alive. But ah, uh, there you go. Even getting these trades, there's so much money. Yeah, thanks for the jinx. Awesome. Well, I had to do it, you know. <laughs> no worries. It surely this is a, is a victory, nevertheless. For the side of Fnatic. A solid setup right now, Durka. Like a big L. For Durka. No real chance at the end of the day. Fear off. He's trying to gain at least a bit of information for his squad as they man equalize the scenario. 
Not at all. Pardon that. Want to put it the other way around. Doesn't matter. Firov keeps on. Two versus five it is. And it remains staunch in round number six. Well, pretty staunch to be frank. Actually, it seems like a flawless so far. Whilst Fnatic's individual duels are costly, at least now Mystic is it. winning them. There you go. No, nah, no worries. I'm going to continue because it's... Ah, and there you go. That's obviously costing your life. You talked about it. I mean, he's eager. He's young. And, you know, against a lot of teams, he can make it work. An absolute beast against most of them. The aggressive approach you often see from him is when he goes over in front of the gates of the A side. Kadafra now giving a lot of information to his teammates. And, well, they swap directions. Did... Hang on a minute. Magnum just killed... Trail in the scenario once more. Another uncomfortable snake bite. Adoma knocking on the back of your head. Easy kills coming in. Yeah, certainly plenty of haircuts being dished out right now. The headshots, thick and fast for Durka. I mean, look at this. I love this one tap. Look onto Juice. It just... I don't even think he knows he's hit that. That's insane. This guy is just brutally melting through it. Oh, well. Seems like that doesn't work according to plan. For the Fnatic side, the Doma's aware of goodness gracious. You talked about Mercy and well, they have families. There you go. Doma's on it. Double secured by him. And Magnum has been sitting behind this wall for a while. Or with the Sage Barrier Orb. I mean, <laughs> good job, Fnatic. They fight another kill. And now they're coming up against two. Sure, refrag, but you lose Feroth, and now it's just Lucker. And he's on it. Well, you okay. should run. revive is absolutely crucial, but the kills on lockdown is coming up next. Mystic, you gotta get out of there, and that happens. It's costly for the Alliance squad because it's costing them time, but Hype's making a move around it. Most definitely, he has been heard, and once that wall goes down, Magnum might just swing and find the opponent's Viper. As I say that, that's a brilliant little swarm. Oh, but this is the problem. He's sneaking around them, and he's waiting patiently to find one, and now Mystic just got to play it. Time is his friend, but the snake bite is going to not get him out of there. He actually made it out of there. As he find the kill no he doesn't and hype brings it home looked close looked tight but should be time? working but we still got so many tools in our belt just starting off good but looker take it back Here. as well as cadaver <laughs> <laughs> are finding great stuff oh, over there and wow. while everybody from fanatic best john snow impression in valorant so far hero in the meantime finds himself dirk that was on the edge still comes around and finds that kill in success, but Boaster absolutely obliterates the crossfire on point and only two soldiers remain over on the Fnatic side. Plant down on the B site. Get that up and get the Viper's Pit to control the ground. Player standing. Yusu, he's realizing what's just coming around. He's not going to be attacked by the drone, but he's going to be taken up by Boaster. That was a wall bang coming in. Oh. Speaking of it, two kills immediately answer there for Alliance as the take starts to come on through, looking for a little bit more openings, but Fnatic denied again at every turn. Boaster next to fall, the knives from the sky get taken down as Dorma lands the headshot now, finds another one with Mystic. In favor of their side, and in the oh. meantime, Hype has been taken out, pardon, has been taken out by nobody so far. This is the right Very one, though, nice. from Doma. As I said, it pretty much jinxed it. Well done, Zesh. And so only Doma Ten remains seconds. on the high ground. He might just find the headshot onto Lucker. Six seconds. Or does he? Four seconds. And taken out. I'm not a fan of it, but I would definitely say Juice is one of those individuals that you can just let let him play Rain on and he's doing his job. Don't worry about it. Now as the spike is going down, though, Fnatic got to do their job, and they seem to make it work to some degree. Magnum. Swing and white. Mystic does the same. The flank seems to be working at the moment. But how much attention do they pay to him? Not too much anymore. But it is Kadavra. Got the sheriff in his hand, but the fanatic side of things are already defusing. You gotta be quick! But Mystic Special, the, the triple kill with the fadeaway on the last one. I mean, look at that double. Goes in for the trade, 14 bullets, gets a couple of shots off and dashes immediately with the tailwind. I, I, I'm gonna coin the early phase of the push. 30 seconds left. It's going to be fairly easy. It's when they get up close that Magnum's going to be looking to shut it down. Boaster with the Marshal, a little bit less of a threat, especially with that wall. 
Magnum's waiting. 15 more seconds. This bike has to go on the ground, by the way, in case you didn't notice. It's still not where it's supposed to be. And they keep delivering pressure. Whoa. But at the end, it should be still working fine. Nice. Oh, that was close. But it was not the spike carrier. Unfortunate for Dirk, he's trying his best. But that would have been amazing. But yes, They're on a, a marshal. They have a sheriff as well. Nice for Durka. So that's why they can invest like that. All five of them not quite finding the kill. But that's going to work. And Boaster gets a second as well. My goodness. I mean, you talked about a big bonus. The big bonus seems to end quite swiftly. All the money they have stacked up in their wallets, put on the table, well invested. Oh, most likely I imagine James is right now in the gym or something. So he's definitely watching or listening or paying attention to that. At the same moment, Magnum is taken down too. That Jusu as well as Lucker and the rest of his uh. squad simultaneously find all the kills. Ooh. Tailwinds, the updrafts, the jets oh. moving around, and the Harrier jump. How is he alive? How does he keep on dodging those bolts? The second kill he finds, a fear of can read and smell it. He almost rather dodging those bullets and moves away. And that prerequisite condition for getting the spike down, well, in this round, it is called the Viper's oh. Pit. Excellent, excellent dart oh, the there. Counter. I haven't even got the spike planted at this point. Luck at, look at her try and finally indenture it into the site. The drop down from Boaster. Look at Ooh. that heads up play. Goodness me. Yeah, but it's oh. No, they got him. And this brings it down to only fear of, but look what he has in his hands. Technically speaking, he could still use his ult. He's not going to do it. Oh. He's not even going to be able to. The ult is coming in. Just trying to lock everything down. Boaster opens up strong. And no now the spike way. just has to go all the way and Durka. Oh, the, uh, if there's one person you want Disgusting. on this flank, it's Durka. He's going to have heard that. He knows. He it's knows. Oh, no. Hype, no. Get out where you still can. Oh, goodness me. I feel like he might have an inkling that someone's there, actually. Stay down. Yep. Doesn't matter. <laughs> exactly. You might know, but it's Durka at the same time. So all your knowledge is not helpful. He's moving away at the right time. This is really something that I love about Durka. He knows when he has pretty much maximized his opportunities with the room he has gained. And he could have stayed there, obviously, and be that single gladiator in the arena, but no, reasonable. Moves backwards, says, I found the kill. Man, disadvantage again on the line side. There. Brings it back into control, moves through, left. and... They're moving into the Viper's Pit. Doma playing forwards in it. Should be able to spot the barrel <gasps> first. Firoth wins the trade. Gets the first pick and opens up. Oh, Mystic. He's falling as well. This means the pit is going down. And suddenly everyone's going down. Firoth and Cadaver HP-wise don't look ideal. But Magnum waits. No, it's just one around Ooh. the left-hand side. And he's going to find it before that spike's going Time. down. So at that point, just dance around it. Get that boogie-boogie with him. But just wait until your teammates the book at that point. Fantastic stuff from Fnatic. They invested two ults. To be fair, they dropped both the Killjoy Lockdown and the Viper's Pit on that round. Fair enough. Shul and a couple of Guardians. This is not ideal coming through from Alliance. A Fnatic looking to close it down. Durka starts strong. And there you go. It's it, At this point in time, they say, I got enough of that. Dirk is pushing through. Oh. He's even getting that spike. After the electrifying Hunter's Fury, Fnatic got enough of your shenanigans. Jusu, I mean, it's time to use your ult, I would say. Could definitely do so. 